Hello friends, welcome back again in a new video. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to make USB pen drive bootable for Mac OS Sierra. So let's get in. So for for making a USB bootable for Mac OS Sierra we need a software called TransMac that you can find in the internet easily. I'll be providing the link in the description so that you can download the TransMac from there, okay? So here's the software, okay? You can download it from here. Okay, so now I already have downloaded it, uh, so I'm not going to download it again. And you need to have a DMG file for Mac OS Sierra. You you can also get that from uh, internet okay so I'm not going to download that also because I already have downloaded so now run transmac I already have installed the transmac and as you can see you can get a free trial version for 15 days and okay after that after 15 days you need to buy it so as I already told you, I have a Sandex here. So I have pen drive called Sandex Cruiser Edge uh, of about 8 GB. Okay, one th important thing: you need to have 8 GB or higher range of higher capacity of pen drive to install macOS Sierra. Okay, otherwise it won't uh, run because the macOS Sierra file is about uh, 4 GB or above, above than 4 GB, so it won't uh, make a boot, boot, booter app application for Mac OS Sierra until and unless you uh, have a 8 GB or higher range of higher capacity pen drive or SD card. Okay, so now for this, you just need to format Dix for Mac. So for that, uh, it will ask you to open this TransMac in administrative privilege. So click on S and press continue. Okay. So after, f so wait for uh, some seconds. It will come back again. Then you can run the program. Okay. Now s right click on the Sandix Cruiser Ace and then for Mac Dix for Mac. And then press continue. And you can name your pen drive what what you want. In my case, I'm Mac OS Sierra. Okay, so continue. It will format a pen drive for making bootable ISO. Sorry, not ISO. Bootable pen drive for Mac OS Sierra. So now format completed. So now right click again and restore with Dix MS. Okay. So now continue and locate your Dix file. I already have downloaded and this is the DMG file. So press open and then press OK. Press yes. So the formatting process uh, starts and it will make a bootable, uh, bootable pen drive for Mac OS Sierra. So guys, uh, this process will take a little bit long time. So uh, I, I'm going to pause this video. Okay. Now the restoration has complete. So now we can eject this pen drive. Okay. can eject <coughs> sorry okay now we can eject and that's it that's how you uh, made a bootable USB pen drive for Max so when you insert pen drive again it will show this process but do not even try to format it. It is because. So do 
do not even try to format this because uh, this file system is not recognized by Windows PC because this is a PMG file and okay this is uh, Windows doesn't support this and says it formatted so don't even try to format that so here is the USB drive so now we can eject this drive and make uh, and install it in your Windows PC eject so uh, for installation process uh, you may know or if you don't know I'll be doing a video on it on later videos so if you like my videos please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like my video so see you guys in the next video thank you very much